In Washington, D.C., another incident, and I told you yesterday, this is always going to happen. So there is a guy, all right, and he, police are trying to detain him because a 911 call said the guy has a gun, which he did, according to the Washington, D.C. police, okay? So the police shot him dead again. If you are an American, it doesn't matter whether you're white or black or brown or whatever color, and you have a gun and the police are trying to detain you and you resist, you're going to be shot. Are we clear on this? So 100 demonstrators right out, oh, another black man shot. Now, maybe it's possible that this was not a righteous shooting. But from the report by the police officers, he, the guy had a gun. And a cop shot him dead. Which you would too. If you were, if somebody was, and the guy punched the cop, I mean, he was resisting. So Black Lives Matter DC tweets out, um, no way they get away with this. Don't let the media black this out like they always do. Oh, yeah. So Black Lives Matter, it's, they're, trying to foment anarchy and destruction. They want to do this. And we'll have more on Black Lives Matter uh, coming up on the corporations who give them money. It's shocking. It's absolutely shocking what is happening in this country. Bill O'Reilly is back on TV and only on The First. No Spin News, every weeknight at 8 p.m. Eastern, only on The First.